hello guys welcome to Nigeria celeb tv on today's video we're going to be talking about 10 nigerian celebrities who are lesbians lesbianism is one practice that is fast becoming a sexual habit among most of nigerian celebrities who now go all out to woo their targets with mouth-watering luxurious gifts in nollywood certain movie stars now form cliques bound together by their sexual preference it may shock you to know that the main persons on this game are the a-list stars if this is your first time on this channel, kindly hit the subscribe button so that you can get a notification whenever we post. Please make sure to give this video a like if you enjoyed this video. Starting with number 10 on our list, we have Alice Iyaba Ojo. Iyaba Ojo was born on the 21st of December 1977. She's a prominent Nigerian film actress, director and producer Properly known for her contributions to the Nollywood film industry. She has featured in over 150 films and has produced more than 14 of her own. She is the youngest of three children, having two elder brothers. She went to school in Lagos at National College, Bagada, before proceeding to study estate management at Lagos State Polytechnic. Yabo Ojo was dragged into a lesbianism scandal after her founded NGO, Sexy Pink Ladies, was discovered to be full of ladies only. As expected, the mother of two debunked the rumors, but new revelations show that it contains some atom of truth. As a result, she changed the name to Pinky's Foundation. Again, Yaba Ujo and her PA were up in lesbianism rumors in 2017 when she bought her PA, Bemini, a brand new car for her birthday, and the internet was on fire over such a gesture. However, this is the same car ABA claims was a gift from one of the ex-boyfriends of Iyabo Ojo, who happened to be a minister in church. The car was a Christmas gift from members in his church, but the minister gave it to Iyabo, who in turn dashed it to Bimini. The popular Nollywood actress poured sparks on the lesbianism report once again when she threw a lavish birthday party for Bimini. This got many talking if the relationship between Iyabo Ojo and Apie is out of the ordinary. Rumor has it that the duo might actually be lesbians, which might be the reason why actress was always showering her with gifts. On the ninth position, we have Susan Peters. She was born on the 30th of May 1980. She's a multiple award winning Nigerian actress with over 50 credits in Nollywood Nigerian films. She's a star on the TV, a successful model, interior decorator, and a beauty salon owner. Peters was born into a military family of Idoma Extraction, Ado local government area, Benue State, in central Nigeria. Her family moved around Nigeria extensively and as a consequence, she speaks several Nigerian languages. Peters was sent to FS Nigerian Primary Schools in FGG College in Wuse, Abuja. She went on to study computer science at Asman English School, graduating in 1998. Later, she studied TV and film at Video Waves and Camera Film School and graduated in 2002. Although Susan Peters regularly speaks about her family in interviews, Susan Peters has opened up on why her 7-year-old marriage was short-lived. The beautiful actress got married to a Dutch lover in a traditional wedding ceremony held in 2015 in Benue State. The couple later had a civil marriage at Ikoyi Marriage Registry, Vega State, in the presence of some of the bride's colleagues in the movie industry. Susan Peters, who had earlier in 2022 quit her marriage, spoke on one of the many reasons and according to her, her ex-mother-in-law never liked that because of the color of her skin. Ever since, she has been discreet about romance and has rarely been linked with any men in popular press. The rumor about how Nollywood actress Susan Peters may be gay was circulated by popular blogger Linda Ikeji and it went viral. She said her tomboy nature might have led to people thinking that she was a lesbian. Also, in an interview with Silverbet Television, she debunked rumors that she is lesbian. People tend to think I'm lesbian because most of my friends are female and I'm always aware of them, she said. The eighth person on our list is Uyayedu Ikbe Etim. Ikbe Etim was born in 1989. She is the co-founder of the production company Hashtag Media House. And since 2011, she has worked to give voice to Nigeria's minority communities, especially the LGBTQ community there. She is a Nigerian writer and filmmaker. 
Yayi Edwigbe, a Tims, another woman who has publicly come out as being a lesbian. In an interview with her sister, actress Nse Igwe Etim, the two discuss how it felt for Uyai to come out to Nse. Nse says that, in retrospect, she wishes he had responded differently by giving her a hug and saying nothing else. Now, the two's relationship is on the path to healing. Uyai also said her experience coming out to her mother on Twitter. Number 7 on the list is Linda Ikeji. Linda was born on the 19th of September 1980. She hails from Imo State. Linda Ikeji is a Nigerian blogger, media entrepreneur, and former model. She is best known for her popular blog, Linda Ikeji's blog, which she started in 2006. Her blog covers various topics including entertainment news, celebrity gossip, fashion, and lifestyle. Linda Ikeji is known for her controversial publications online. She also ventured into online radio broadcasting. She was accused of being a lesbian in 2013. People were quick to notice that Linda, who was known for sharing scandalous news, did not seem to say anything about these news. Also, she is mostly seen with women and not men. On number 6 on our list, we have Uche Ubodo. She was born on the 17th of May 1986. She's a Nigerian actress, producer, and red carpet host. She came into the limelight in 2006 with her debut movie, Another Bondage, and has since then acted in other movies like Four Sisters, Players, Your Holiness, Your Last Action, Honor My Will, The Laptop, and The Royal Palace. Born in Enugu State in the southeastern region of Nigeria, to Godwin Ogbodo and Ada Luisa Ogbodo as the second child in a family of five, Ogbodo spent most of her teenage years in her hometown. She is a graduate of Banking and Finance from the University of Nigeria. She shared a controversial picture of her kissing a fellow actress Rosalind in November 2018. When she lashed out at her fans, she came out to say that she was only acting her role. Before moving on, if you are enjoying this video, don't forget to give this video a like and subscribe to our channel. On number 5, we have Ruth Cattery. Ruth Cattery was born on the 24th of March, 1988 in Benin City, Edo State, South South, Nigeria. She was the first child of two children. Her father's name is Desmond Cattery. She studied mass communication at the University of Lagos and Business Administration at Yaba College of Technology. Cattery ventured into Nollywood in the movie Boy Scots and since then she has had over 50 movies to her credit. She posted a controversial picture in 2016 where she posted with a picture of her with her friends. While a few did not see anything wrong with the picture, others felt it was her way of coming out of the closet. When asked, the actress laughed and said, I am not a lesbian, it was just a harmless picture I took with my friends. While we are about to set out for a private beach to have some fun. The first person on our list is Temi Ovwasa. She is a visual artist, poet, singer, and songwriter known as YBNL Princess. Temi is openly gay and revealed that she knew about her sexuality from the age of five. Her debut album, Ibila Sedem Swear For Me, is hailed as the first openly queer album in Nigeria. Temi has revealed that she doesn't want to have children in the future. She considers herself heterophobic and wouldn't be happy if a child turned out heterosexual. She's a radical feminist and is outspoken against sexual abuse, especially against children. On the third place, we have Pamela Adie. She's a filmmaker, screenwriter, activist, and public speaker. She's a passionate LGBTQ activist. In 2019, she wrote, produced, and directed the LGBTQ plus documentary, Under the Rainbow, based on her life. She also executively produced the first gay film in Nigeria, Yufe, in 2020. Although Pamela Adje is one of the most vocally openly gay celebrities in Nigeria, she was once married to a man. However, she revealed in an interview that she knew it was a mistake only 24 hours into her marriage. Adje went to therapy with her ex-husband, but nothing could fix her feelings. However, she said that everything finally made sense when she came out to herself. On number 2 on our list is Rita Dominic. She was born on the 12th of July in 1975. Rita Dominic is a multiple award-winning Nollywood actress, producer, model, television personality, investor, a philanthropist, and a co-founder of the Audrey Silver Company. She has been regarded as one of the best industrious actresses in Nollywood and also one of the highest paid actresses in Nigeria. For those who are conversant with Nollywood movies, you can attest to the fact that no one plays lesbian than Rita Dominic. The scene between Rita and Bimba Kintola in the movie Girls Cult led to a lot of speculation. In 2015, it was also presumed that she was dating a presenter, Michelle Day Day, especially after posting a picture of them kissing. 
And finally, the number one person on our list is Genevieve Inaji. She was born on the 3rd of May 1979. She's a Nigerian actress, producer, and director. She won the African Movie Academy Award for Best Actress in a Leading Role in 2005, making her the first actor to win the award. In 2011, she was honored as a member of the Order of the Federal Republic by the Nigerian government for her contributions to Nollywood. Her directorial debut movie, Lionheart, is the first Netflix film from Nigeria and the first Nigerian submission for the Oscars. The movie was disqualified for having most of its dialogue in English. The story of the Beninese actress slash musician Ella Martins and Nollywood star Genevieve Inaji being lesbians was actually broken by an online magazine in 2013 and this created a big buzz. Although Ella Martins and Genevieve reacted quickly to smash everything, it seems that the echoes are still heard. As a result, Ella became popular in Nigeria after the allegation of lesbianism between she and Genevieve. When Ella was asked about sharing a kiss with Genevieve, she said, we kissed, but it was nothing extraordinary. It was just a normal kiss between girls. I mean, girls do kiss each other, normally. Even guys do too. Although she was accused of wrecking the marital home of Olamide Agunloye, who is an alleged bisexual, it was said that she made Olamide abandon her child and her husband. What are your thoughts on this video? Mention other celebrities you know should be on this list. Please drop your comments below. Don't forget to like this video and turn on post notifications to this channel in order to get notified whenever we post exciting content like this.